Park in Toronto in support of seven Ontario youth. Sophia, Shelby, Zoe, and Shaylin. Alex, Madison, and Benz. They are suing Doug Ford's Ontario government for scaling back plans to cut emissions because their reduced climate target violates our constitutional rights. The event is hosted by EcoJustice. I am speaking to lawyer Danielle, who is helping to represent the youth. We have a charter of rights of youth and future generations in Ontario, correct? So in Canada, there is a charter of Canadian rights and freedoms. And under this charter, we have rights like the rights to life, to security, and to equality. That's really cool. What charter rights does this scaling back violate? So we know that Ontario's actions in contributing to the climate crisis will cause things like heat waves and floods and infectious diseases. And so we say that this case involves youth's rights to life, to security. So for instance, from impacts from uh, on your health, your physical and your mental health in climate change but also equality because we know that young people like you and future generations are the most at risk of climate change. Last year, the Supreme Court ruled that climate change was a threat to human life in both Canada and around the world. The province has stated that the government of Ontario have no duty to prevent future harm. That so this sounds insane. Did they even have a chance to win? So Ontario is trying to say that its emissions are so small that on a global scale they don't matter. While we say that governments around the world have to act in order to address the existential threat of climate change. So we don't think that they are right on that point and we will be arguing that on court. What do you hope the outcome of this decision will be by the Ontario Superior Court? So we hope that the court will say that when Ontario decided to go backwards on climate change, it violated youth and future generations' rights under the Charter. We also hope that the court will tell the Ontario government to set a new target and a plan that are in line with science. Thank you. This is Zoe. She is one of the plaintiffs. Hi Zoe. Hi. Hi. Ford struck down Kathy wins legislation, which our parents all voted for. How can they even do that? And how much worse will Ford's new legislation be? Yeah, so when Go the Ford government came into power, they had a climate target, and Ford, the Ford government struck down that target and weakened it a lot. Um, and as we know, this is a critical decade for action. So everything they do, everything our government does in the next eight years will affect our generation forever. And so by striking down that legislation, Doug Ford failed our generation and um, we need to hold them to account. So that's why we're going to court. Your lawsuit states that the new laws violate our rights to equality because climate change affects the communities who have done the least to cause it. Has climate change already affected the kids in your community at all? Yeah, I think like Climate change is a really big driver of mental health crises in my community, and I think that like climate change will also affect so many kids in the future, and so it's the government's responsibility to protect us all. Yeah. Thanks to all these brave.